Hello children. Today we are going to learn about building numbers. Rebecca had lots of ice cream sticks. She was finding it very difficult to count them all. Her mother gave her an idea. She asked her to count 10 sticks first. Rebecca started counting and she counted 9 sticks. Let's count with her. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. Her mother said these 9 sticks represent 9 ones. 9 ones make the number 9. Then she added one more, the tenth one. Her mother said, now there are ten sticks. Her mother said, now tie these ten sticks together and make a set. Rebecca tied the sticks together and made a set of ten sticks. Ten ones is equal to one ten. Her mother said, 10 ones make 110. Rebecca was very happy and she started making more sets of 10. Rebecca made 10 bundles of 10 sticks each. Let's count with her. 1 tens, 2 tens, 3 tens, 4 tens, 5 tens, 6 tens, 7 tens, 8 tens, 9 tens, and 10 tens. Her mother said 10 sets of 10 make 100. 10 tens is equal to 100. Now let's learn how to build numbers using blocks of 1s, 10s, and 100s. This green block represents one one. Since we know that one green block represents one one, let's count the number of ones on the screen. One, two, three, four, and five. Five ones make the number five. Now let's count the number of ones on the screen. One one. Two ones, three ones, four ones, five ones, six ones, seven ones, eight ones, and nine ones. So there are nine ones. Nine ones make the number nine. Now let's see how many blocks of ones we have here. Let's count. One, two, three, four. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. There are 10 blocks of 1s. Now we see that all these 10 blocks are joined together to make a bar of 10. Now 10 is represented by this red bar. That means 10 ones is equal to 1 10 which can also be written as 1, 0, 10. Here, we can see a bar of 1, 10 and 2 blocks of 1s. That means 1, 10 and 2 1s make 12. Now, let's try to guess the number on the screen. There are 2 bars of 10s and 3 blocks of 1s. Since there are 2 10s, Let's write the number 2 at tens place. And since we see that there are 3 ones, let's write the number 3 at ones place. So, 2 tens and 3 ones make the number 23. Now, can you guess this number? There are 3 tens. 3 tens is equal to 30. Now let's see how many bars of tens we have here. 1 ten, 2 tens, 3 tens, 4 tens, 5 tens, 
six tens, seven tens, eight tens, and nine tens. So we have nine bars of tens here. That means nine tens is equal to ninety. On the screen, we can see that there are ten tens. Now these ten bars of tens have been joined together to make this yellow grid. This yellow grid represents 100. That means there are 10 tens in 100. 10 tens is equal to 100. We can write it as 1, 0, 0, 100. Now, can you guess this number? We have one yellow grid of 100, two red bars of tens, and two blocks of ones. That means 100 plus two tens plus two ones is equal to 122. Now here we have two grids of 100. So what is the number? The number is 200. Here we have two grids of 100, one red bar of 10 and two blocks of 1s. That means 200s plus 110 plus 21s is equal to 212. Here we have three grids of 100s, three bars of 10s and three blocks of 1s. That means 300s plus 310s plus 31s is equal to 333. Here we have one grid of 100 and four bars of 10s and 0 ones. So we write 1 at 100's place, 4 at 10's place and 0 at 1's place. This makes the number 140. Here we have 300s, 0 10s and 9 ones. So 300s, 0 10s and 9 ones make the number 309. Can you build the number by counting the blocks here? Here we have 200s, 4 tens and 1 1. And the number is 241. Can you count the number here? 300s, 2 tens and 3 ones. And the number is 323. Here we have 600 and 110. And the number is 610. So here we have 700 and 2 ones. So 700 and 2 ones make the number 702. Now, what do we have here? 300s and 2 tens. So, 300s and 2 tens make the number 320. So, now count the number here. There are 200s and 4 tens. So, 200s and 4 tens make the number 240. So can you count the number here? There are nine hundreds, nine tens and nine ones. So nine hundreds, nine tens and nine ones make the number 999. On the screen we can see that there are ten grids of 100. Now these 10 grids have been joined together to make this pink grid. This pink grid represents 1000. That means there are 10 hundreds in 1000. 10 hundreds is equal to 1000. We can write it as 1, 0, 0, 0, 1000. Hope you have understood how to build numbers.
keep revising by building numbers at home. Stay safe and keep smiling. Bye-bye.